Welcome to Kid Brewer Stadium, home to the Giant Killers, the Appalachian State Mountaineers. And Boone, North Carolina, has really been excited for this matchup that we have in store. We've got a terrific matchup for you today, rich in pageantry and tradition, and it ought to be a fantastic clash. As we'll see a squad from the ACC, the SMU Mustangs, taking on a team from the Sun Belt, the Appalachian State Mountaineers. For EA Sports College Football, Reese Davis with you alongside David Pollock and Jesse Palmer. Time to get this game started. And the Mustangs will kick it away first. And here's the return. And the returner runs out of real estate. Here comes the offense on first down. Looking to throw at Aguilar. Unloads to the wideout. They intercept it. Trying to take it back. And a big return after the INT sets up the offense for this possession. If that's setting the tone, then the tone is screeching nasty fingernails on the biggest chalkboard in the world. But I like it. You're throwing on the first play of the game, right? You're trying to be aggressive. You're trying to send a message to the defense that you're going to take shots and you're going to push the football down the field. But come on, man. I mean, you've... And he takes it in for the score. Touchdown, SMU! The proverbial rabbit out of the hat getting out of the Houdini-like blocks, calling reverse and trickeration, and it worked. It does, and it's frustrating, because defensively you're thinking run, 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 and you're playing aggressive, and on that backside, man, you gotta stay home, you gotta be alert, you gotta do your job. When you don't, here comes the reverse, here comes the touchdown. Just into the end zone, and he'll bring it out. Stopped at the 17, and he's probably second-guessing that return. The Appalachian State offense returns to the field. Well, the good news about this drive, Jesse, it can't go worse than last time through a pick on the first play. No, it certainly can't. I think one good way, David, to help your quarterback turn the page is just find him an easy completion here and let him get back into a rhythm. Yeah, or find him an easy handoff. Just hand the football off, maybe get the ground game going, maybe jumpstart this offense a little bit. Offense gets set for second down. He's looking to throw. Fires to the big fella. He's brought down solid pickup, but a little bit short of the first down. And the Mountaineers want to crank the tempo. It'll be a run on third and short. And maybe he'll get back to the line of scrimmage, but no more than that. They're in their own territory, but they only need a few inches, and this is why you square your prominent jawline and go straight ahead to get it. And he's knocked down, but not before moving the chains. Yeah, I like it. I like the confidence of the coaches. When you're an offensive coach, you've got to be aggressive nowadays. And going for it in your own territory, it used to be, no, you can't do that. Now, everybody's like, you know what? Analytically, that makes sense. The Mountaineers have it with a first and ten. Use the play fake, now to throw. Off the deflection, missed a great chance to force the turnover. Instead, it'll be second down. 
Oh, man. The quarterback almost just threw his second interception on as many drives. He's trying to fit that football in there. It gets tipped up in the air. He's lucky that wasn't picked off. Looking to throw, it's Aguilar. Nice defensive play to get a hand in there and knock it away. Let's see what call they have on third and long from the 28. From the gun, wants to pass. Fires into traffic, picked off. Takes it the other way. At the 20. Touchdown, Mustangs. The defense puts six on the board with a big-time interception return. What a play by this defense with the pick six. And how about the defender? Exactly what you're supposed to do. Breaks on the football, makes the interception. Everybody on defense, we turn to offense. Go lay some blocks so my guy can get it and take it back to the house. He'll start the return inside his five. He was looking for some running room, but not much to be found as he stopped at the 18. Appalachian State regains possession, and the Mountaineer offense headed to the field. To say this has been a slow start is a bit of an understatement, and they really need to get it going here, Jesse. That's right. The opponent, they're firing on all cylinders right out of the gate. Offensively for this unit, they've been slow and struggling. They need an explosive play to wake themselves up. Yeah, and it's just the first quarter, so it's not the end of the world. You've seen slow starts, but you got to continue to pick and pick and pick until you find that play or, or that scheme that you can use against this defense. They came out humming on this drive, and now it's first down from the 36. The give. Just sort of a relentless run, getting everything that was available to him, and they'll mark him down at the 40. I, I like it. Just frustrate the defense. Get that five to six yards. Make him honor the run. Make him know that you're willing to run the football and run it effectively. Back to pass. It's Aguilar. And he really needed to hold on to that one, but it was not loose, and third down is coming. And the Mountaineers are in the hurry up. Looking to throw on third. Quickly out to the tight end. Good pick up there as he gets the first down, and they'll mark him at the 48. Hard work pays off, guys. These offenses work so hard week in, week out working on those critical down and distances third downs and having that conversion this early in the game that's got to feel good for this offense throws to the wide out oh quarterback just flat missed it incomplete no huddle offense to the line looking to throw on second down Damn. this time he's got his man and he almost ran away from everybody on that one. A huge pickup on that play. Time winding down in the quarter as they come to the line. Got it? Going up top on first down. A strike downfield. And he'll run it into the end zone. Touchdown, App State. Big time touchdown there to get some much needed momentum. You gotta find something, right? Who are you gonna go to to make that big play to get you back into it? You're not back in it yet. It's not, it's not tied. You're not there yet, but you're starting to inch back into it and get some momentum going. They'll try to tack one more on their score. And after the extra point, they've cut the lead in half, down 14-7. What? The scoring drive there of 83 yards. And the score comes on a touchdown pass covering 28 yards. Kickoff team lining up to send this one away. And they thought about a return, then thought better of it. They'll bring it out to the 25. They'll be able to get off one more play before quarter's end. 42, Spider. 42. 
The give to the running back from the shotgun. At the 35, Dang. he's got room. They wrestle him to the ground, but he's got plenty for a first down. Here's this offense with a fresh set of downs. Comes out throwing on first down. Fires to the wideout. He's got an open man. That is exactly what you're looking for when you talk explosive plays. The defense finally able to make the stop. And this set of downs gets started from the 33, first and 10. Oh, come on, radio. And good coverage by the defense. Just Great play by the cornerback. He was just way too physical at the point of attack. He beat his man trying to block him, and he tackled that receiver on the screen. Back to pass. It's Stone. Unloads to the wideout. He's got it. The Mustangs getting set on first and ten. The give to the back. Not much working there. It'll be second and nine. Yeah, and, and listen, offensively, you run the RPOs. You just want positive yards, make the right read, read the guy. If he wants to drop back a little bit, hand it off, get some positive yards, go on to the next play. We've reached a two-minute warning, and we'll see if the offense can build on this lead before the break. Operating in the red zone here on second down. He's looking to throw. Knew where he wanted to go with it, but couldn't find his target. It's incomplete. Well, there was something the quarterback liked in the pre-snap there, thinking his primary target was going to have a favorable matchup, but the defense did a nice job disguising that look. They got more bodies over to him and forced the incompletion. A third and long here. They can't pick up the first down without getting the touchdown. And oh, no, he loses the ball after the huge gain. That looks like a really easy thing to do. Oh, the ball's just on the ground. Jump on it. That's an odd-shaped ball that bounces all kind of crazy ways. Great job by the defense covering that thing up. The Appalachian State offense returns to the field. They unleashed an aerial assault last time that took them right to the end zone, David. So, Reese, with that drive, I think you've accomplished something you wanted to accomplish. Make this defense think. You put them back on their heels. Now, shoot, Palmer, you might be able to slip a few runs in on this drive to really jack them up. Yeah, I like that idea, but I also like the fact that Let's speed go. kills. Let's and they've go. got it at the receiver position, so if you've got one-on-one -on -one matchups, man, take advantage. Trying to find his man on first down. Throws to the wideout. He makes a catch. He's run out of bounds, but a big play on that one, and it'll be a first down. Great job by the quarterback thrown against zone coverage. You cannot telegraph where you're throwing the football. You cannot eyeball wide receivers. So great job by the quarterback using his eyes, not staring down his guy. And the catch and run into the end zone. Touchdown, Mountaineer. Offense slips the running back out of the backfield. Nobody decides to cover him. My man makes the play. Shows off the hands first. Got to make the catch first. Does the rest. Walks in the end zone for the touchdown. And they did tack on that extra point with no problem. Quick strike offense on that three-play scoring drive. And they close the deal with a 16-yard throw for the touchdown. After that latest answer, tied things up. Just about set to kick it away again. And it'll come out to the 25. No attempt at a return. The SMU offense is headed back onto the field. That fumble in plus territory just ruined that last drive, David. Yeah, and those are frustrating when you've got the offense moving a little. Oh, it's on the ground! This nigga fumbled. Now the defense has got it, and they're going the other way. Man, and it was just the... Oh, bro. ...of the hit that dislodged the football from the ball carrier. They was a heat-seeking missile... Hey, my fucking ball, baby. Bitch, I was down. <laughs> and 
Fuck out of here. Now they're trying to piss me off now. They'll snap this one from the 42. It's first and 10. He's going to pass. Looking left. All kinds of room to throw that one in there. They're ripping off chunks of yardage. They get it to the 33. This offense is like running a perfection drill in practice against air. Chunk play after chunk play. And here they come again. Quarterback making adjustments with his receivers. Fires to the wideout. Makes a connection. He stopped just short of the goal line at the one. An explosive play has him set up. And the Mustangs have it in scoring position on first and goal. They'll try to get it in with the run. Nowhere to run on that one. He loses four on the carry. So on offense, you've got to find a way to put six up on the board. You know that in this game, field goals may not get it done. So big-time players make big plays in big games. Who can you rely on right now to get you a touchdown? Dropping back, it's Stone. Buying some time as he moves left. Touchdown, SMU! And they add six more to the board with that trip to the house. And in that goal line situation, awesome job by the tight end, winning his one-on-one -on -one battle, making an easy target for his QB. And the extra point is true, and they're on top by seven. A very efficient five-play scoring drive. And the score comes on a five-yard touchdown pass. The kickoff team on the field as they'll send this one away. Oh, he's going to take a chance. Not nearly as much as he'd hoped when he brought it out of the end zone. He'll be stopped at the 15. Looking for a productive play on first down. He wants to throw. Makes the catch. It's Roberts. Makes the stop at the 30, but a big 15-yard pickup gets him out of trouble. They'll use a timeout right before halftime. Maybe time for one or two more plays. Time dwindling away as they try to put points on the board right before the half. Wants to throw on first down. He can't find his man, and the clock stops with six seconds left. Just enough time for one final play in this half. Fires to the middle. Wide open downfield. A timeout is called as this offense tries to find a way to get more points on the board before the half. They love nothing better than to add a three ball here before the break. Oh, that one will leave a mark. No There's no way good. fucking hell is going to be good. After that miss, still a seven-point game, guys. I guess they're trying to send a message to start this second half, lined up for an onside kick. Few anxious moments there, but the hands team... as they make the grab and get the ball. The Mustangs see that shit still fucking going on. To go to work. They had this lead to start the third quarter because of the passing game. Didn't get a lot done on the ground. They did, but the quarterback is in a rhythm. That was obvious in the first half. And so this first drive, you want to continue that. You want to see good decision-making. You want to see him playing on time. And as always, delivering the football with that. I, I mean, I don't know how I don't give him the football. It's the reason I built the lead. He's the guy that I can trust. This offense is built around him. So I expect more of the same here in the second half. And it's okay that that ball's incomplete. It's important this offense comes out and they show that they want to be aggressive. They show that they're willing to take shots and they're going to try and take the top off of this defense. Not able to connect on that one, but that will not be the last deep ball we see in this game. Third down conversions are a huge stat and this one would be a doozy if they can pull it off. Pulls it in. Finally run out of bounds, but he has this offense rolling with a first down. The Mustangs come to the line with a new set of downs. Get 
from the shotgun, the handoff to the back. Relying on that running game as they... Bro. Pick up a four down to the 13. Okay. Going to work on second down in the red zone is still some ground to cover to pick up that first down. Scanning the field, it's Stone. Going for six. Pulls it in the end zone. Touchdown, Mustangs. They'll try to add another to their lead. And the extra point is good for a 28-14 lead. A very efficient five-play scoring drive. And they finish it by firing one in from the 13 for the score. From back of the end zone, he'll bring it out. And the ball is loose on the return. The kicking oh, we got, got it. Shit. Oh. The ball right back. Man, this kickoff coverage team, they just get to the ball carrier. They are flying around. They're beating their blocks. And the ability to create a turnover on a special team's play like this, and that is massive. And got some room headed to the goal line. And he runs it in. I don't understand like, why I keep doing it. It's been doing that shit since Madden 20. I, I don't get it.
<laughs> Mama's lying, dad is lying, Huddle does not see. <laughs> this shit is the fucking truth. <laughs> and this gonna lie, Phil. Motherfucker gonna tell on your stupid ass. Hey man, why the fuck you didn't block the uh three tag? Man, what you talking about? Yes, I did. Bitch is on film. You did not see it. You did not block the three tag. Man, man, what you mean? I did. So you fucking lying to me, son? Man, no. <laughs> oh yeah. Bro, huddle, 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 motherfucker, bro. I told you to run a fucking pose, not a slant. Man, what you, what you mean? <laughs> I said we're playing cover two to the three, uh, three receiver side. What you mean cover two? 